In today's video, I'll be showing you how to push your FPS and fix any lag in game loop. So let's not waste any time and get into the video. So what you want to do for the first step is you want to head over to the Windows tab and you want to head over to Settings. Then you want to make your way all the way to Privacy and you want to scroll down and you want to find Background Apps. Once you click on it, you want to turn off your background apps. Then once you're done with that, you want to go ahead and open up your task manager. You want to click on startup. Now you want to disable all the startup apps that you don't need when starting up your PC. So once you're done with that, you want to head back over to your Windows tab and click on settings. Then you want to make your way to the gaming. And you want to turn off your Xbox game bar. Then you want to click on game mode. And you want to turn on your game mode. Then click on the right hand side on graphic settings. Click on browse. Then you want to head over to this PC. Click on your local disk. Click on program files. And you want to find the folder TX Game Assist. Then you want to click on UI. Then you want to scroll all the way down and you will find Android Emulator. Click on that and add it. Then once you add it, you want to click on options and you want to put it on high performance and click on save. Then you want to hit back over to browse. Then you want to add the emulator EN. So click on that and add it. Then you want to click back on options and you want to click on high performance and click on save. Now once you're done with that, you want to open up the game loop and you want to upcheck for any updates. Just in case your game loop needs an update and that might cause any lags. Now once you're done with that, you want to head over to settings. Then you want to deselect auto run and you can copy my first page of my settings. Then once you're done with that, you want to head over to engine and you want to put it on direct X plus. Then you want to deselect enable rendering cache, deselect force global rendering cache. And you want to enable VSync. Your inter analyzing, you want to put that off. Your memory, you want to put that on 4 gig. Your processor, you want to put that on 2. But depending on what CPU you have. Your resolution, you can copy the resolution I'm using to get the best settings. Your screen DPI, you want to put that on 160. Then you want to hit over to model. And you want to copy these exact settings. Then you want to hit over to game. And you want to put it on SD720. The graphics quality put on smooth then once you're done with that that was the best game loop settings if you found this video helpful please give it a like and also subscribe to this channel for more tips and tricks just like this see you in the next video